I was born February 12th, 1809 in Hardin County, Kentucky. My parents were both born in Virginia of undistinguished families, second families perhaps I should say. My mother who died in my 10th year was of a family of the name of Hanks. My father removed from Kentucky to Indiana in my eighth year. It was a wild region with many bears and other wild animals still in the woods. There I grew up. Of course, when I came of age, I do not know. Still somehow I could read, write, and cipher, but that was all. Those were his words, but indeed that was not all. For this boy from Hardin County grew up to be Abraham Lincoln, the 16th and many feel the greatest president of the United States. The cruel tides of fate collided in Abraham Lincoln's adulthood, obliging him to serve as president during the greatest threat this nation has ever known. And yet, through it all, Abraham Lincoln heard a song of unity, a song of freedom, and a song of peace. In his first inaugural address on March 4th, 1861, he said, We are not enemies, but friends. We must not be enemies. Though passion may have strained, it must not break our bonds of affection. The mystic chords of memory stretching from every battlefield and patriot grave to every living heart and hearthstone all over this broad land will yet swell the chorus of the Union when again touched, as surely they will be, by the better angels of our nature. 